Hey, this is Brad with Forty Tech. Today we're in a Subaru Outback. This also applies to the Legacy. We're going to show you how easy it is to pop in one of our start-stop eliminators so that you don't have to hit the button every single time you get in the vehicle. We'll go ahead and start by opening the sunglasses compartment and removing the two 8mm screws holding it in place. Next, we're going to go ahead and remove this plastic trim that covers up everything, including the stereo camera. You can do this by hand or get some help using a plastic dash removal tool. Get it in behind, releasing the clips holding it in place. There are several at the front and here. Then we're going to pull down and pull it off of the hooks in the front. Gently get it around the rear view mirror and we're going to tilt it out of the way. Next, you'll go ahead and you'll notice that there's a connector plugged into the stereo camera assembly. Up at the very top in the center, there's a clip that we need to depress with our finger. And when we do that, we'll put depress and wiggle the connector out. Now, all we need to do is simply plug the start stop limiter in line with the camera, making sure to hear a good click, making to ensure that the connector is fully seated. You'll also notice that when we plug in the connector to the vehicle, the start stop limiter will blink momentarily to let you know that it made it an electrical connection. We're then going to go ahead and tuck it in up above the stereo camera assembly so it's out of the way. You can also use the included zip tie to secure it if you'd like. We're then going to replace the entire trim assembly. Again, remembering that the front edge needs to go up on the hooks first before we clip everything else in place. and snap it into place. Now that that's done, we'll go ahead and replace the two eight millimeter screws that hold the assembly up. And that's now complete. Now that the install's complete, we'll go ahead and start the vehicle for the first time. As you can see, by default, it turns the auto start stop system off and it will retain that setting every single time you start the vehicle. At any point in time, if you'd like to turn it back on, you can go ahead and simply hit the button. It'll turn the system back on and it will retain that setting as well. Now you see how easy it is to pop in the start stop eliminator from 40 Tech. I'm Brad. Thanks for checking out our video.